Hey, it's Jim from Janku here, and I want to take a quick look at a bug I found in the Olive Editor. So when I export my recordings from OBS Studio, they export to a file format called MKV, and when I import that into Olive, basically the first few seconds of audio are missing in the recording. So let's just take a look real quick. I, I did a quick browse online, and I found this Reddit post about no audio for the first few seconds. So um, it's the same exact thing I was experiencing. And it's actually noted in here that um, the file format here is the same as well. So I came here, I, I added a comment about having the same problem when I'm exporting uh, on my Ubuntu 18.04 laptop. And I found a quick fix. So basically, if you convert the file format to an MP4, it seems to work on my end. So let me just show you kind of what I'm experiencing here. If I go to my homepage, I made this quick recording, and this is the .mkv file from OBS Studio. If I play this just regular right here, you can hear the audio. So let me just pull that up. This is a test video in OBS Studio where I start talking at the beginning of the clip. I want to see if all of can play back this audio and not have a delay with it. So, okay, so that audio sounds fine. It starts right off from the beginning. That all seems good. Now, if I go back to all of here and I import that audio from my desktop. So let me go to my desktop. Let me grab this file here. And then if I open that and I pull it into my timeline here and I play it, I want to see if all of can play back this audio and not have a delay with it. So you notice that the audio, even though you can see the waveforms here in the audio track, doesn't actually kick in where you can hear into about this section in the video here. Now, if you export this video, it is missing from the actual exported video as well. So one thing that I've done that seems to have worked successfully is if I go to my command line here and I actually run this ffmpeg command, I can convert the file on my desktop over into the, uh, the the MP4 format, and then I can import that, and that seems to work. So let me just grab that file here. So that's the file on my desktop, and then I'm gonna convert it into this test.mp4 file. So let me run that command. Now, if we go back to our desktop, you can see that this MP4 here, this test MP4 has been outputted. So now if we go back to all of, we can right click in this pane and import a new file. We're going to import the test MP4. If I grab that and I drag that down, the audio should play back immediately in this case. So let's see here. So I have, oops, okay, we're all the way back at the beginning. All right, let's let's bring the playhead back and start off from the top of the video. This is a test video in OBS Studio where I start talking at the beginning of the clip. I want to see if all of can play back this audio. So that seems to work. So we don't really need this one anymore since it's the exact same video with the exact same audio but now it's starting off the bat right immediately. So that's great. Uh, I think that's all I need to be able to do, but if you wanted to kind of cut out one step, so if you want to cut out the step where we actually convert the file using uh, FFmpeg on the command line, you could actually go into your OBS Studio settings and under here under settings, if you were to go to your output, you can actually change which kind of recording format you're using. now. I'm, I'm currently running recording, so it's not going to let me change that. So you can see it actually gives you that warning down here. Uh, recording with software encoder. Oh, maybe that's a different warning. Anyways, if your recording is stopped, you can actually go and you can change this to an MP4 format. And that way you can just kind of export directly to the MP4. And that should work with all of immediately. All right, thanks for watching. Hopefully that's helpful. And I'll be doing some more tutorials on all of in the near future.